During the 15 years or so that I have been um, coming to uh, Dr. Palmer, I have found him to be the most brilliant dentist, both brilliant, both as a technician, but also because of his aesthetic uh, bend, if you like, because he has treated me for all sorts of problems. And um, I could not recommend him highly enough. He, he's brilliant. I had implants. He has uh, cut uh, molars in uh, half to save the teeth. He's patient. He, <laughs> words fail me. Just, just, just brilliant. <laughs> I say, often say to him that what I admire about him is not just his technical ability, but I think he's an artist too, and it's true, and it's a very rare thing to find individuals combining both. And I can tell he's an artist, A, because of the results, but also I can see how he works. And he plans. I can, see, I can even see his mind working. When I present him with a problem, my teeth are in a terrible state or whatever. And he does say, oh yeah, we need that, that's it. No, he thinks about it. Sometimes I even, he even says me back. And he says, oh, no, I'll think about it. He takes notes, he takes photographs, x-rays, all sorts. And then he discusses it. And then the result of that, I think, the outcome I have found is really good. I suppose it's vanity as well. But I don't feel old. I don't feel my years. So my teeth would betray me to me. You know, I look teeth. Why are you looking like that? I didn't tell you. <laughs> That's not me. So the teeth I have are more the teeth that I feel I should have. And I'm very lucky to be able to get them through Dr. Palmer. I think he's a brilliant dentist. Very competent, very, very patient, very pleasant, as are the, the people he works with, the receptionist. The whole atmosphere is really good. So he both fixes the actual physical problem, but he gives you something that looks good. He makes it as pleasant as it can be. I know people are afraid, a lot of people are afraid of uh, going to the dentist, but I can't think I could be better, really.